Geeks, Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com, and say we're going to look at codec packs a little bit briefly about what they are and why you might need them. Codec packs are basically all the components you need to properly play any audio or video file. Most modern players will have what you need included, but some of the older players will not. So if you have Windows Media Player and it won't play some of the newer formats, or actually Windows Media Player doesn't support quite a few formats, some of these codec packs will install all the components needed for you so that it will play properly. There's other issues too. Beyond the new versus old players, most modern players, again, will probably play what you need. You could have had a malware infection, and as you know, many malware infections can screw up your system even though you get the malware out. You have problems. Let's say you got a malware infection out, and maybe you have some registry or playback issues. Maybe the codecs, the basic codecs, can be installed and restore so that your video player or audio players are playing properly. You could, uh, in the higher levels, you can actually convert from high to higher level audio or video. You also might want to do some re-encoding, which would bring you into a whole different level because most codec packs come in a couple of different levels. Uh, another thing very similar to what we were talking about before is you may have changed players. You want to install the player, went to a different player, doesn't support one of your favorite video formats. There you go. So basically, if you come to Major Geeks and you go to Multimedia, and then you'll see we have a whole codec section. For the most part, these codecs need to be updated on a regular basis because they are a collection of files inside it, a collection of codecs. Downloading anything more than a couple of years old was probably a bad idea because you're going to be running outdated codecs. So we'll go forward now. We'll just kind of show you which pack you can use, and then you can decide what you need for your situation. So now let's look at the K-Lite codec packs, one of the most popular on the Internet. They come in four versions, basic, standard, full, and mega, depending on what you need. Basic should cover most of you for most of the popular formats, and then they work their way up until we get into the mega, which is higher end encoding, decoding, etc. There's also, as you can see, we're back where we were, the sort popularity codecs. If you come here, you'll see that they're in the most popular. There's also this update pack. If you already get the codec pack, you can grab that when it's updated about weekly and make sure that it only updates what you need to update. This keeps you from having to reinstall the packs, everything. So we're going to start with where most people should go, but probably don't, and that's the basic. Most people actually go to the full. There's a good reason for that. We'll get to it in just a second. In the description, it's going to tell you what it does. In this case, as mentioned, should play all the common audio and video formats. Then right here, with links, basic, standard, full, and mega. As you can see, it starts out with the basics, works its way down to adding media player classic, Starts adding more stuff as you go. Again, you're back into the encoding, decoding, and the higher level stuff. Um, if you're not, if you're just trying to watch stuff, this is the stuff that you really don't need. And they're much larger downloads in comparison. So just a tad further down the page, you have a comparison of abilities. If you're not sure at this point, click on that. It opens up their website and has a great little table here broken down, as you can see, into basic, standard, full, and mega. As you work your way down, you can see if you're trying to play VCD, which is somewhat popular, the base won't work. So now you know you can jump to full. As you can see, there's plenty of green, so it supports out of the box. You know, you're looking at audios, MP3, AVIs, DivX. This is all the popular stuff, MP4, all covered with the basic pack. So you come back down here. Now, if you run into some of these, you can see we're getting to lesser known extensions here. Basic won't do it. Standard won't do it. If you need to play these here, you're going to have to jump to the full or the mega. And again, just keep scrolling right down. It breaks everything into a category as your audio formats covers just about everything. And the obvious, which we keep explaining to you, which is the video and the audio encoding. As you can see, all your video and audio encoding are going to take you right to the mega. So pretty much as simple as that. What I'll do here is I'll put a link down below to the basic packs, so you can grab the basic pack or just go through it as I just showed you and decide what it is you need. Uh, take a second and subscribe. We'd appreciate that. And we thank you for watching as always. And hopefully we'll see you next time.